Welcome to Historical Highway, where history comes alive with every discovery. Today we delve into the heart of Egypt, unearthing secrets buried for millennia. Join us on this incredible journey through time. Egypt, a land where history whispers from every sand dune and pyramid, recently gifted the world with astonishing archaeological finds. Imagine unearthing a mummy that dates back 4,300 years, discovered in a deep shaft near the Steppe Pyramid at Saqqara. This is not just another mummy. It's one of the oldest and most intact ever found in Egypt. But why does Egypt, a civilization that peaked thousands of years ago, continue to captivate us? It's not just the pyramids or the mystique of the pharaohs. It's the unending stories lying beneath the surface, waiting to be told. In a significant excavation, a team of intrepid archaeologists stumbled upon a tomb that left the world in awe. This wasn't just any tomb, it revealed secrets that had been hidden for centuries, shedding light on aspects of ancient Egyptian life that we had never seen before. Egyptian archaeology is like an endless well of stories. For instance, the discovery of a royal goldsmith's tomb by the Nile's West Bank this goldsmith, a devout worshipper of the god Amun, lived over three to five hundred years ago. His tomb, discovered after months of meticulous digging, offered a glimpse into the opulent and devout life he led. But that's not all. Imagine the excitement of uncovering the tomb of Ramses the Great's treasurer, Fayuya. Buried deep, this tomb held sarcophagi and artifacts dating back 3,200 years offering insights into the lives of those who served the mighty pharaohs. Beneath modern Egypt's bustling life lies a labyrinth of history. The recent discovery of an ancient geometric tunnel is a testament to this. This tunnel, reminiscent of the engineering marvels of ancient Greece, might lead to the final resting place of the iconic Queen Cleopatra and her lover, Mark Antony. Switching gears, we move to Luxor, where a Roman city was recently unearthed. It's like stepping back in time, walking the streets of a city that thrived during the 2nd and 3rd centuries AD. This discovery is more than just ruins, it's a time capsule, offering a rare look into the daily life of an ancient civilization. In the realm of Egyptian mummification, we often think of it as a practice reserved for the elite. But recent findings challenge this notion. Mummification was a deeply spiritual process, believed to aid in the journey to the afterlife. It wasn't just about preservation, but a profound act of reverence and belief in the afterlife's mysteries. Our journey takes a surprising turn with the discovery of a unique falcon shrine. Unlike anything we've seen before, this shrine offers a glimpse into the religious practices and beliefs of a time long gone. The presence of decapitated falcons and mysterious inscriptions opens doors to new theories and interpretations of ancient spiritual practices. As our exploration comes to an end, we marvel at the recent discovery of King Tutankhamun's iron dagger. Made from meteoritic iron, this dagger challenges our understanding of ancient metallurgy and its origins. It's a symbol of the technological advancements and the deep mysteries that ancient Egypt still holds. Continuing our exploration, we come across the fascinating story of the lost city of Thonis Heracleion. Once a bustling trade hub, Thonis Heracleion was lost to the depths of the Mediterranean Sea over a millennium ago. Recent underwater excavations have brought this ancient city back to light, revealing a network of canals, temples and colossal statues. The city's discovery provides a unique insight into the life and times of ancient Egyptians, their trade practices and their religious ceremonies. Next, we turn to the Valley of the Kings, a site synonymous with grandeur and mystery. This valley, home to the tombs of pharaohs and powerful nobles, has been a gold mine for archaeologists. The discovery of the tomb of Tutankhamun in 1922 by Howard Carter was just the beginning. Since then, 
Excavations have unearthed numerous tombs, each with its own story and treasures. The Valley of the Kings continues to be a focal point of Egyptian archaeology, with new discoveries revealing more about the burial practices and beliefs of the ancient Egyptians. Egypt's history is not just about the pharaohs and the wealthy. Recent excavations have shed light on the lives of ordinary Egyptians. Discoveries in the workers' village of Deir el Medina, for instance, have provided invaluable insights into the lives of the artisans who built the tombs in the Valley of the Kings. These findings tell us about their daily lives, religious practices, and the challenges they faced. It's a humbling reminder that history is not just about the rulers, but also about the people who lived and worked in their shadow. Moving on, the discovery of the tomb of Queen Nefertari, one of the most celebrated queens of ancient Egypt, was a significant event. Her tomb, found in the Valley of the Queens, is renowned for its stunning wall paintings and intricate decorations. These artistic treasures give us a glimpse into the royal lifestyle and the high esteem in which Queen Nefertari was held. Another monumental find was the discovery of the ancient city of Abydos. This site, one of the oldest cities of ancient Egypt, held great religious significance. Recent excavations have uncovered a royal palace and a series of temples, offering new insights into the religious and political life of early dynastic Egypt. As we journey through Egypt's vast deserts, we come across the Temple of Karnak, a testament to Egypt's architectural prowess. The temple complex, dedicated to the Theban triad of Amun, Mut, and Khonsu, is a sprawling labyrinth of chapels, pylons, and obelisks. Each pharaoh added their own contribution to this complex, making it an evolving canvas of Egyptian history. Our journey wouldn't be complete without a mention of the Sphinx of Giza, a mysterious statue that has puzzled historians and archaeologists for centuries. This colossal structure, with the body of a lion and the head of a human, is believed to represent Pharaoh Khafre, overseeing his Great Pyramid. Recent studies have attempted to unravel the secrets of its construction and purpose, adding another layer to our understanding of ancient Egyptian civilization. In conclusion, the sands of Egypt continue to reveal their secrets, painting a picture of a civilization that was advanced, complex, and deeply spiritual. From the grand pyramids to the humble tombs of workers, each discovery adds a new chapter to the story of ancient Egypt. As we continue to unearth these treasures, we gain a deeper appreciation for the ingenuity and spirit of the people who lived thousands of years ago. Remember, history is a continuous dialogue between the past and the present, and each discovery reshapes our understanding of human civilization. If you've been captivated by these tales from ancient Egypt, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Historical Highway. Join us as we journey through history unearthing mysteries and bringing the past to life.